Hello guys, welcome to another episode. Nothing much about today. Today we are going to study immunology, and we only have forty days left for the exam. The pressure is building up, kinda, but I need to study because, as you saw in the last episode, I did not study for the last two or three days, and my productivity has been on an all-time low. So we have to sit down and at least complete immunology today, or else this will also remain a backlog, and that is a big headache to cover. So let's get started. I know I said there are forty days left for the exam, but that was in the past. You are going to watch this video on January twenty second, and that means I gave my micro paper one yesterday, and micro paper two is going to be tomorrow. And I'm talking about the final exam, and I am very, very, very stressed probably. So just give me some motivation in the comments, yar. I'm actually happy that I put in some extra hours even during my preparation just to be consistent with YouTube and my uploading schedule. So please consider subscribing because I'm trying to reach 10k subscribers before my birthday that is on June 8th 2025 so hit that subscribe button Hello guys it's 4 o'clock currently and now we are going to go to the gym I studied like 30 or 40% of immunity and this is also a very big chapter so yeah planning mistake on my side but <laughs> we can't do anything now we'll study as much as possible and then remaining Whenever we find time, we'll finish off. I just did a small workout, so I did not record much, and then I came back home and read some more immunology for around two hours. Hello guys, good morning. It's eight o'clock in the morning, and uh, I woke up at six o'clock only. I didn't know what to do. I was like scrolling for forty minutes, and then I decided I won't sleep anymore. Then I woke up, I did shower, I did all that, and now I sat down on my desk. So it's eight o'clock now. So again today we do not have anything in schedule and today we are going to complete that immunity that is left over from yesterday. I don't know why I woke up. I just suddenly lost sleep. So then I started studying while having some biscuits and then it was starting to get cold and I was dozing off on my desk. So I went to my bed and wrapped myself in the blanket and within few minutes I fell asleep. Hello guys, it's three o'clock currently and nothing much has happened today. I slept for like three hours and you saw everything. So. Not a productive day overall. Actually, I haven't been productive since like four days or something. Even the last episode, two days, I wasn't productive. This episode, I'm not being productive at all. Only. Then I started studying, but I really could not focus. I don't know why. Like some days are meant to go to waste. Like no matter how much I try, I cannot be as productive as I wanted to, and it's irritating sometimes. But this is where we should not get demotivated and still try to study something so that even if we don't complete how much we wanted to, we would at least complete forty to fifty percent, and that's better than doing nothing and give up, right? A few hours later. Hello guys, it's 7:30 currently, and I have studied for like past two and a half hours, and I haven't recorded anything because I was literally irritated with the fact that I am not studying since like three or four days, and I am lacking behind my schedule. And I just threw my phone to a side on the top shelf in another room so that I don't even look at it. So yeah, we have studied successfully for two and a half hours, and I gained my focus back finally after a lot of struggles. So. Feeling great. We have completed immunity. Then later, I had my dinner and saw late and done. That's it for the day. Hello everyone. Yesterday we did not read general microbiology because I was busy watching late and chalo wo din to gaya. Now today we are going to start serious infections and I am hoping we should complete this year. <laughs> I don't want any backlogs anymore. I have a lot of backlogs already and yeah, I cannot handle any more backlogs. So hopefully we complete this today. It's three o'clock. So let's get started. And if any neat aspirants are watching this video then say hi in the comments and I hope you guys are preparing well because the competition is through the roof since the last 2 years and if you want to make a timetable for yourself for the next 5 or 6 months then go and check out the link in the description and that video will be very helpful for you guys so check it out Hello guys it's 7 o'clock currently as you can see and I have had crazy good focus in the past 3 and a half hours and we are doing great actually I did a lot of topics like typhoid fever and then your HIV and what else infective endocarditis acute rheumatic fever brucellosis leptospirosis lot of things and yeah we are doing great now I will take a deserving break of half an hour and yeah I'll see you at 7:30 or something and you can see me studying at different places like sometimes at the desk sometimes at the bed and all those places so changing the place where you study actually helps sometime because it creates a new environment and helps you focus a little bit better because our brain doesn't really like monotonicity so when you change place or you know sit in a new room or new environment it will help you focus better and get some work done hello guys it's 
and today has been absolutely amazing like i studied very well and we have successfully completed cvs infections in one day that's great the thing is on general microbiology i wasn't really focused so yeah that's the obvious reason i didn't complete it that day because if i completed cvs infections in one day then general microbiology should have been easily done but koi nahi hota hai so we have that as backlog and tomorrow we are going to do editing the entire day so yeah finally some break i guess we won't burn out so yeah feeling great bhai now i'll have a good sleep because i have successfully completed cvs infections in one day so yeah good night bye bye see you and the next day the entire day i was busy editing and i shot a video on the new background so it looks very good hello guys welcome to the next day it's freaking cold outside i'm sitting under my blanket literally and uh, it's 1:30 right now we have to start studying but i literally don't want to i just want to go under my blanket and sleep for like 3 4 hours but we have to stop complaining and start to study because exams are coming closer and we cannot afford any more backlog so let's get started it's fight over well and i just kept a story for my video today is wednesday actually so video got uploaded and i actually haven't studied anything properly i just studied properly for one hour i guess the rest of the time i was just doing time pass and i couldn't focus i think i'm going to make another backlog today but i don't want it yaar tumse na ho payega Hello guys, it's 10:30 and nothing much happened since morning, so we are not making any progress. But previously, I studied for like one and half an hour, and that was good, but not helpful because I read only a little bit. But now it's 10:30, so we'll study till like 12:30 and hopefully finish off some amount of GIT. Entire is not possible because in three hours you cannot finish a unit. So yeah, now we'll read a little bit of GIT and let's get started. Hello guys, it's 12:30 currently, and I am contemplating whether should I go to sleep or just read two more topics because I only have to read Ascaris and also Hookworm, so I will almost complete all the major topics in GIT. That will be like completing about 60% of GIT, but it's 12:30 and I want to sleep, so I'm just <laughs> thinking around and uh, being lazy, I guess, but. I want to study I also don't want to study because this is anyhow going to be a backlog and I don't want it to be a very big backlog so that is what is making me want to study but the time is making me want to sleep in the next 5 minutes I'll decide and if you see a time lapse that means I studied if you don't see a time lapse then I'm going to sleep a few minutes later Hello guys welcome to the next day today we are finishing GIT no more talking let's get started Just friends but I'm taking you out Make moves but you run me around the world Back to the pull your house the sun is getting high but you're shooting me down down Hello guys, it's 6:30 currently, and from 1:30 to 6:30, right? So in five hours, we read approximately three and a half hours or four hours around figure, and we have successfully completed GIT. So we have the rest of the evening and night in order to start hepatobiliary. Also, I don't think we'll complete that, but maybe we can complete. But even if we don't complete tomorrow, we have some time. I kept some time as buffer day tomorrow. So So yeah by tomorrow we are going to complete liver also and then day after tomorrow we are going to start pharma literally look at my desk guys there are like random papers this is like lab diagnosis of GIT this is for cholera mind map and then this is mycotoxicosis and all that 
this is some lab diagnosis this is some classification sheet this is a book this is a tab and now i am eating pasta in my break so yeah see you later then i studied a little bit more and that's it for the day hello guys welcome to the next day yesterday we couldn't finish a pet biliary so today we are going to do that so let's get started Hello guys, it's eight o'clock, and I haven't recorded in the past two or three hours or something. So what happened is I started studying at something around twelve o'clock or one o'clock, right? So I studied for one hour. Then at two thirty, I started to feel sleepy. So I took a half an hour break. I came back at three o'clock. So I sat down at three o'clock on my desk, and then I was reading, reading. Then again in half an hour or something, I couldn't focus. I couldn't complete anything. I was just stuck in a single page, repeatedly reading the same few lines. So I thought maybe I'm not focused enough. So I thought. i would go and get a coffee so i got some coffee and then by the time i drank it and sat down and again all that process happened and then it was 4:30 then again one hour i did some time pass then it was 5:30 i was like oh i'm wasting so much time then i threw my phone aside in a shelf in that room and then i finally sat down and studied for like what uh, two and a half hours or three hours something like that and now it's 8 o'clock so we have successfully completed hepatobiliary actually it is a small chapter but i'm so distracted that is why it took so long but anyways we have completed it successfully and uh... we don't have any goals for today maybe i'll complete some backlogs or something like that but you see i'm not productive always i'm not focused always even i get distracted a lot even i am addicted to my phone and shorts youtube shorts is like a literal addiction for me and i keep watching youtube but anyways yeah that's the point even i get distracted some days and some days are like this only so yeah phone will be the root cause of the problem if nothing else is so just put your phone aside in a separate room or give it to someone your mother or father and then sit down to study you'll automatically study don't give reasons just go and keep your phone aside and you will study automatically so we are done for today and that is it for this vlog if you are watching till here it means a lot thank you so much and subscribe so that we can hit 10k subscribers before my birthday that is on june 8 2025 so please hit that subscribe button i'll see you next wednesday until then bye bye